Why are you team? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to some more Hogwarts Legacy. To help my twin sister. Oh right, we're gonna do this dialogue again, are we? Okay. Because Merlin knows everyone book? else has given up. <laughs> Why do you think you'll find a cure in the restricted section? Hmm. Does it's the a Hogwarts good question. Have nothing that can help Anne. No, we've tried everyone from Nurse Blaney to Saint Mongo's, but I can research on my own. No need to concern yourself with that right now. Tale as old as time. On what you're after. Right? Which is what? Precisely. He's turning to the dark oh, arts with good You're intentions. What's the finger box? You see how that plays out, eh? Are we going to learn a lesson? It's like, oh, I know you want to heal your sister, but it's not worth moral blah, 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 blah. Can I Levioso this? Levioso. Oh, I can just spinny it. Okay, my bad. My bad. All right, what the fuck is going on here? Um, oh, I know, I know, I know, I know. Repairies. Oh, hang on, how do I slot this? Repairer. What the fuck? Who have we here? Oh. It's the best oh, no, oh no, we've been busted by the ghost men. Out exploring where they shouldn't be. Hmm. Naughty, naughty, you'll get caughty. Oh, he's gonna dog. What a scumbag. What do we do, Seb? Oh, blast of peeves. I've got to stop him or at least get to the librarian with a good excuse for all of this. Correct. Can I trust you? Of course I can trust you. Don't get into trouble, man. Wait, I don't want you getting into trouble for no. me. I have a way with the faculty when it comes to disciplinary matters. Besides, I like having friends who are in my debt. Jeez, that sounds sinister. Good luck in your search. Now, where is a bit, bit mask off? <laughs> I anyway. know just the spell to repair this armor. What the fuck is this beast thing, but it's facing the wrong way? <laughs> it's weird. Oh, hang on. Repairies. So people said, Spinnies, people said that they're enjoying the more sort of long form episodes I was doing. So guess what? Silver Four Eyes Spectacles. Sorry. I'm not very good at finishing my sentences. Um, let's let's do some longer episodes then, eh? Let's do the hours. People like that? I like that. Now what's going on here? That's just objectively better, is it? More defense? More defense? Oh. <laughs> Yeah, let's go, man. Oh, I do like, I probably should check out some other YouTubers and streamers. There's a real fashion component to this. If you haven't already, you should join our Discord. You know, pop, a, pop a photo of your ugly Harry Potter fashion. Of course. Traces of ancient magic. Ancient magic. There must be more to this room. That's Investigate. Ancient magic Aliramos. Oh, right. Hang on. Ooh. Oh, it's so... It's so clever using this sort of um, architectural wizardry that you can't do in real life, but you can only really do in video games. Even doing it CG in movies can be tricky as well. Oh, draconic long coat, son. Let's go. What's going on here? Oh, it's an orange, a legendary. Oh, that looks really good. Goes well with my hair. Oh, they've got a sell value as well. Ugh. Oh, I've got more offensive magic. Where might this lead? God, listen to yourself, Scarlet, you loser. It goes well with my hair. <sighs> I don't know, man. Like, I don't know if I... I've never really gotten into fashion in video games. Though, I was going to say... What's going on here? Revelio. Sounds like I can hear something over there. Um, wow, that's cool. These like uh, things. I need to tree wake roots up that and that. Over there. You have to what? I wasn't listening to you. All right, hang on. 
Oh, even there. Um, oh! Hang on. Um, yeah, like Sea of Thieves does an interesting thing because every reward is cosmetic. So what it does is it changes the economy of of fashion. Revelio. Look, they're baddies over there. <gasps> Not surprising. Guards at the ready. Who's? Who's? <laughs> All right, I think I've used up my down the bottom right. I don't think I have any more of those. Oh. Stupefy. Oh, I'm in third party. Shit, that hurts so much. No, I need, I need this. This is what I need. Firefy. Alright, has he got a mate attacking me as well that I can't see, like over here? Or was it? Oh, it was just him. No, it wasn't. Oh, he's dead. Any more for any more? Your gift of ancient magic accumulates by successfully attacking or taking damage. Uh, successful 10 plus hit combos begin generating ancient balls. Oh, yay! Magic balls! Collecting these will greatly fill your ancient magic meter. Great. Fill me up with your magic balls. When uh, at least one segment of the ancient magic meter is full, you can cast a devastating... Yeah, we figured that out by accident. You can zap fucking dudes in the top of their head. Is there anything going on in, like... Revelio. Revelios? No. Cool, look at that. That's swirly stuff. Anyway, I was talking about cosmetics. I, I found that the way that Sea of... Because if you've never played Sea of Thieves, all the money that you earn in that, which has its own meta game to it as well. But you can't buy any sort of engineered upgrade in game. Everything is cosmetic. And everything's really expensive. So it shifts this. Everything is the bragging rights. Oh. I probably could have killed him, launching him off the edge, but... Let's go. Oh. Hang on. Can I... Can I get there? Oh! Ceramic mask. Let's go. I was pressing the wrong button. Oh no, my goggles are gone. Do these 15, 16? <laughs> this is a bit nightmare fuel, you know? Eyes wide shut sort of energy. Oh, okay, and then you can double back. Okay, cool. Now, anything else out here? Yeah. Anyway, I'll stop talking about the cosmetic thing. I just find it interesting playing dress-ups, because I'm someone that's sort of more... I'm, uh, I'm more motivated by gameplay. Wait, what happened then? It's like a puzzle. Except for someone not stupid. Alright, zapped. Oh, okay. Oh! Easy. Easy. I didn't I didn't even flinch. Which way we go here? Probably the only way. This must be the way forward. But to where? But to where? Let's go there. Now what's going on? I want to go over there because that's the thing. Now I'm becoming so motivated. Because also the stats don't seem to matter yet. Oh look, there's something down there. Buckaroos! Well, I can see it! Oh, you know what? That might be the way back one. You know how. 
Oh. Oh. Wait, can will this will this change it? <laughs> oh, I'm so smart. Decorous jumper school uniform. Oh. Let's trick kids into wearing school uniform. Like, or kids, fuck, or adults that think they're children. Moi. Let's trick them into playing this game and we're going to reward them with what? We're going to reward them with bloody school uniform clothes. So that's extraordinary. Le and this is level eight. So that gives me more defense. Crimson Voyager garb. Trait slots too. So that's, and also that's worth more as well. So it's just objectively better. As opposed to wearing a bloody plain Jane <laughs> school uniform thing I do. All right, well, let's keep wearing this. And then we'll, um, hang on. How do I bloody transmog? Fuck, where's my, where's my decorous uniform? Yeah, 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 he's figured it out. I could, I guess I could turn this off, couldn't I? I gotta, I gotta press the right button. Oh, look at this. Look how boring I look now. Yeah, let's, let's roll, let's roll boring for a bit. Oh, yeah, I was gonna say shit. I hope it doesn't reset me. Right, so I'm gonna have to zap it again. Nearly there. That's cool. Best I like that a lot. About me. Ooh, dude, stop giving me rewards. Gold trim debonair ensemble. Oh my god, you're gonna you're gonna make me froth. What is going on here? All right, so that's just better. Ooh, look at me. 1900s good looking lady, apart from the weird mask. Then what's this? Neapolitan striped scarf. Oh my god. <laughs> the wordplay is, is quite cool. Like all the, like what was this called? Gold trimmed debonair ensemble. <laughs> but now we've got a matching Neapolitan striped scarf. It's, it's so wanky but to be honest i'm i'm here for it man i'm rolling with it i'm embracing the the oh my god look how many bad guys right then a zappy armis right, you're dead you're dead who's next you yeah i guess yes exactly him all right can i just push him off the edge no Stupefy. Oh, I can knock him back with the combo. That's sort of what my brain's trying to do. Right, so if- oh shit. Oh! So, I'll get you with that. No, wrong guy. Shit. I'm gonna push you up and I'm gonna combo you off the edge. Yes! Oh, it works! Oh, might have been a bit of a waste that, but that's all right. Ah, shit. All right, I'm getting, I'm getting better. I, I actually think the juggling interplay, especially with the ability to throw people off cliffs, like environmental components, it's really cool. Like so far, it's, I wouldn't say it's super difficult, but it's kind of tricky if you want to engage with all the mechanics. You know, it's taken up more gray matter than I would normally allow. 
Again, put on like a brain condom. Don't, well, that's what the mask's for. Don't just go sticking your head into some random person's memories. Who knows what they've been up to? Oh, God. Okay, sure. Yeah, yeah, good, great. Like, what if, what if they did horrible, torturous things to someone and you get to stick your face in that? Oh, who are these blokes? I recognize the little fat, dumpy one that was on the left. Jeez, when is this set? Like, we're already in the late 1800s, right? Alright, there's no well water for little Timmy. Sorry, mate, guess you'll die. That's pretty cool. And now we just... Well, I, I, what, what is the ceiling on this magic, man? Right? <laughs> we can just make a green utopia, can we? Never mind that the... Uh, the... the uh, the climate of the geolocation that you're in put it into a drought in the first place. So when you guys walk away from here, all this shit's going to die in the next couple of days anyway, right? Though you did put entire full-grown trees there that can take like a hundred years to grow. Let's go on there. Oh, is this her? Years later, all grown up. You wanted to see me, Headmistress Fitzgerald. How, how old should be then? Like eight or something? Miss, and now she'll be eighteen. Dora Ten Morgan. years. Welcome, Professor Rookwood, Professor Bacar. Oh, the, okay. There's the, the faculty. You are adjusting well to life at Hogwarts. I am. I am glad, especially in light of your unusual situation, starting as a fifth year. As it happened, oh. I was also admitted to Hogwarts as a fifth year. I've never heard of another like us. I have me. Miss Morganock, when we spoke yesterday after class, you asked about the beautiful swirls you saw years ago when we visited your hamlet. I recognized you all immediately. I cannot thank you enough for what you did. We were glad to help. And yes, I did see swirls of magic everywhere uh -huh. that day. My father insists it was my imagination running wild, but it was certainly real to me. It was not your imagination. Percival, Professor Rackham can see them too, but we have never known of another who could. I don't understand. Oh, this is an ancient magic thing. The whispers or traces that appear when a particular form of ancient Wait, magic Wait, so they couldn't see it? Wielded. They were using ancient magic. magic and they can't even see it? Few are capable of wielding it. Hogwarts itself is a stronghold of ancient magic. Of course it bloody is. So if I can see traces of ancient magic, does that mean I can wield it too? With the proper training. But let us not get ahead of ourselves, Miss Morganock. Before I can train you to wield such magic, you must first master all that Hogwarts has to offer. Ah, oh, so she's a, a bloody Thumbelina riddle, right? It must be wielded by a select few. She's going to turn into the goblin dude Such and become the bad guy. Do not speak to anyone about what we have discussed here today. Look at her. Look, look at her, how thirsty she is. Oh my god, I'm going to blow so many people's heads up. Um. Okay. So, a few thoughts. Power creep. Let's just create this new... Fuck, I look stupid. Sebastian. Let's just create this new type of magic that um that no one's heard of, but it's better than everything. And how come all of those professors could use it if only one of them could see it? Clearly, detention. Scarlet has questions. I'm afraid I must take this to the headmaster. Oh no! But that being said, look at this. Peeves informs me that you didn't come alone tonight. Come on, Sib. Someone has coerced you. I would have you tell me. Big boy You're time. A bright boy. Don't waste this. I, I believe in Sib. There was nobody else. 
I came alone. Yeah, cram that in your bloody hole. Oh, Sebastian. What will your uncle say? <laughs> oh, that my nephew's not a piece of shit. Nice, good work, Seb. Absolute Chad. Now what do I do? Secrets to restricted zone. Okay. Wow, 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 wow. Gobs of gobstones? And what's this? Question mark. Gobs of gobstones. Maybe the mission's about to update and I don't realise it. Am I going to get busted by the prefix if I roll out here? Or will they have conveniently despawned? It's all a bit quiet, isn't it? Actually, I'm getting a quest marker now. What's this about? You got tomes and tri tribulations. Return to Professor Fig's classroom. Locate on map. Oh shit, it's a bit of a walk, isn't it? Um. God, this map shits me to tears, to be honest. Trap. Let's make a map so unwieldy and such a pain in the ass that people will prefer not to fast travel. Imagine, imagine if that was the, in fact, the design philosophy. That would be tragic. Uh, will I get in trouble for being out after after dark? God, how pretty are those tapestries? You see different things when. I've uh, always said that travel broadens the mind. Yeah, right, mate. You see different things when when there's no foot traffic around, you know? Hello? Begin. Oh, I guess no sleep then. We'll just sit here all night. Hello? Spinnies. You cannot be serious. Goblins working with Rookwood makes no sense. Oh. Cool. It is rather unorthodox, Who's this bloke? to say the least. Unorthodox? It's inconceivable. It's... Ah, Fig. You have a visitor. Me, I'm home. I'll see visitor. what I can find out. Hmm. Oh, Professor Sharp. Sure. I was able to search the restricted section while you were with Professor Black. It was a book we were after. It's ten points to Hufflepuff. It's me, oh, baby. That's... Wait, you accessed the restricted section? Yep. But how? I'm a woman of means. Thinking on it, perhaps it's best you spare me the details. Correct. Fair enough. In fact, the book was below the restricted section, as it appeared on the map. I want to hear everything. First, let's have a look. God, my character looks dumb. <laughs> I love it. Oh. The best bit is that there oh will be dear. some people that wear all this shit some and go, fuck my character looks thing. cool. I wish I looked the like that when I was at school. Before us. And I'm like, memes. Still, I will need time to study what remains. Hmm. Perhaps we can still salvage something useful. It may take some time. Hmm. I wonder why it was here, below Hogwarts. I think I know, sir. I saw two more memories where I found the book. Another pensive, Godric's heart. The yeah. man we saw before, Percival Rackham, was a professor here. The first memory showed him and three other professors using ancient magic to restore a hamlet from a drought. Miriam was right. And the second memory? In the second, they were talking to a student who started as a fifth year, like I did. She could see traces of magic too. Mm. Why those memories? This is a very Harry Potter mm. story. Perhaps this book Like, it's good. Play. It's big, heavy mystery. Now I have to take it with me to London. And then I'll probably neatly tie it up has with some that dumb expression. to the minister about George's death. Oh, no good. What will you tell him? What will you tell them about Mr. Osric's death? That it was grisly. I don't know how much I dare say. George tried to convince the ministry about Ranrock, but to no avail. My instinct is to follow the path we are on for the moment and keep the details to ourselves until we know more. Fair enough. That's probably a good move. I understand. I'll see what I can learn about the missing pages while you're gone. Good. 
Don't neglect your studies. So the book has some your pages torn is improving by the day. But you'll want to pay attention in herbology and potions. There's more to magic than spell casting. Okay. Thank you to keep me occupied while you're gone. You've done exceptionally well. I look forward to seeing all that you've accomplished when I return. Oh, and don't neglect your friends. Hmm. You may be surprised by how much you can learn from them as well. Also, you know, friendship. But if we want to just look at it as a transactional relationship, okay. Don't forget your friends. You can use them to advance yourself also. All right, my thing's saving. Saved. Read mail. Oh, it's time it? to prove your dueling metal and see if we've a new school champion. Oh. Meet me at the usual place for the final round of crossed ones. Sign me up, Lucan. Still available. Oh, what's it? Meet me in Lower Hogsfield as soon as possible. Saber Brown. I would like to talk to you about Rookwood and Harlow, oh. and it might be best to do so outside of the castle. Wait, how do you know about them, Natsy? Maybe, um, maybe like I chat with her in my downtime or something. Collections, inventory, gear. Oh, it's a handle. What's this? Oh, isn't that cool? Mate, cool beans. What's in my inventory? What's going on here? Quest items, there's nothing there. Okay, game. the game's flipping out. Quests. Spell combination practice. Yeah, let's do that. Locate on map. Jeez, he's all the way over here. Bloody hell. How do I zoom into there? Where's the nearest uh, doodacky? Oh, there's one right there. Huh. Here we go. Cool beans. Appearance of gear can be altered to look like any other basic gear you have looted. Professor Fig and Weasley have asked that I teach you an additional defensive spell. Lower Please Hogsfield Hamlet. The assignments I have given you, and then proceed. Sorry. Wait. Select the world map. It's teaching me something. Oh shit. Covered by fog. There are small communities throughout the world. Look at this! Hamlets and new opportunities for vendors, flu flames, side quests and collectibles. See me in my classroom. As you explore, you remove fog and reveal more of the map, unveiling opportunities like Hamlets, dungeons, bandit camps! Bro, it's Skyrim! Professor Hellcat's assignments, the girl from Oogadoo. Bring me back to the map, please. Alright, so what's the go with the Hogsmeade map? So Hogsmeade is just sort of like, uh, how do we say? Sort of like, the, is it called the Spire or whatever the fuck in Destiny? You know, like that central hub. Maybe I should play Destiny. Maybe I should just do it. <laughs> I enjoyed Destiny 1 immensely. Um, and I played through Destiny 2 so fast in launch weekend that I can't even remember what it's about. No, 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 go back to the map. So Hogsmeade is sort of its own shop instance. And then... Hogwarts map is this. Oh, world map. It goes around in a circle, so there's three of them. Look at this. Look at this. What is going on? Uh, can I zoom out? If you see an oak icon, hover over it and reveal any hidden things at it. Okay. Yeah. Clagmar Coast. North Ford Bog. Dude. Oh, enemy levels as well. Look at this. 10 to 25, 20 to 40. How big are we going to go? How big are we going to go? Four, 15 to 40. South Sea Bog. All right, it looks like 40 might be the ceiling. Aren't I like... I'm already like level 9. Jacked tits. All right. Lucan, what do you got for me, mate? That's me, buddy. I'd like to practice with the training dummy. Yeah, teach Hello, me the Luke. combo system. I'd like to practice with the training dummy. Yes. Excellent idea. This time will be a bit more of a challenge. Ready? Mate, I was born ready. That would be brilliant. Wonderful. I'll set things up. Remember to cast all the spell combinations before the dummy lands again. 
If you need to stop practicing, yep. So it's all about juggling air combos. Let me know. I understand. Bum 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 bum. All right, we're gonna pull. We're gonna fire, and then we're gonna. Good one. Thingo. Levioso. Perform basic three casts. Accio Incendio. All right. All right. One, two, three. Boom. And then, yeah, so it's like a scorpion. Get over here. You know? I kind of, actually, that's a good comparison. It's, the combo chaining is taking on more of a fighting game thing. More than even just abilities in, say, like a, like a Batman normal WB fighter. Even though it's got the counter system. Um, okay. Fire. Oh, dude! Oh, right! You can juggle them until your cooldowns reset. My cooldown didn't quite reset, though. I wonder if you can get cooldown reduction or something. Alright. So if you go a little bit slower... That's kind of cool, man. You're almost incentivized to go slow. Impressive wand work. I'd hate to face you in a duel. Couldn't have done it without you, Thanks, man. Thanks, Lucan. You've been a great help. Oh, stop. Don't make me blush. <laughs> Seriously, well done. What a, what a little charmer. Some dummies will think twice before challenging you again. Uh. Plus, you'll be even more formidable in crossed ones. Yes. Other duelists had better beware. They better beware. I'll make their heads explode. All right, speaking of dueling. Hello, Lucan. Is the final round of cross Final round. round. Big oh. match today. It all comes down to this. The moment that we find out if your training and dedication is enough to win it all. Ready for a shot at glory? Yeah, mate. Let's go. Absolutely. I certainly am. Brilliant. Are you dealing with a partner? I mean, why wouldn't I? We'll take Sebastian. N Nancy seems nice, but I got to yes, pick one, Sebastian. and I'm enjoying then I'm enjoying Sebastian's company. We can make this a real victory. Look at this ranger. Get out. That's the spirit. Uh, I I can't get over how they've made even though everyone's in the same uniform, all the different you know heads. The students actually look, dare I say, I don't like saying this word because it's it's overused, but diverse, but appropriately, you know. They all look like different pimply teenagers. Break through the red shield with damage spells. Yeah. Okay, got it. So I don't think I can make colored shields. Not really. I mean, I can just do that, I guess. Oh, this bloke's in the way. Oh, I killed him. Ah, ah, I'm on fire. So, do their normal little bullets not telegraph? Ah. Oh shit, health potion. Fuck, hang on. Puss. Dude, I'm getting bashed, man. I'm on fire. I'm on fire. I'm gonna die from fire. I'm gonna die from fire. Shit. I need to be closer. Ah. Alright, I'm one hit, man. I need to focus here. Oh, oh, oh! God damn it! I thought I pressed it. I must have been stuck in an animation or something. 
They made a crap's breakfast out of you that round. Oh, easy on there, mate. Just four or two. Yeah, let's yes, go again. I'm ready now. Very yeah. well. Yeah. Good luck out there. All right. So, I wonder if I want to be trying to like. Do you? Here's the question. Okay. Use your thoughts. Use your words, Scarlet. Does comp like juggling is all good and well. However, I think the the sort of CC abilities, you know, the floaties and all that, they don't really do much damage. Or if they do, they don't actually act as a multiplier. Ergo, I should probably be trying to CC the ca the other kids as much as possible. Why is my target not changing? It was that's why I was struggling just then, because it was playing up. Oops. Alright, so CCing them is, is king. Oh my god. Is it though? I mean, I did just get dumpstered. Care to try again? Maybe it's not. Yes, I'm ready now. Very right, well. Let's... Good luck out there. <sighs> okay. Maybe I just bash one dude. God. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. How do I? Ringo. I'm accidentally cloaking because your counter is to hold this button. How do I? Can I like just clear it? I can't clear it. Uh, oh, yeah, okay, let's do that. Let's do that. Yeah, because I keep cloaking by accident, because if you hold right trigger and Y, it does that. But if you also just hold Y for the counter... Fuck you, man. Why won't you lock onto this Sheila standing in front of me, fuck game? Maybe locking on's not the move. You know what? Lock I think locking on is... At least when it comes to a group battle, locking on is not really the move. Oops. I tried to... I tried to press fire then, but I accidentally jumped. <laughs> okay, that's cool. That's interesting. The, the, the locking on... Is, is kind of shit. Like, it, it wasn't rotating very well. It's an honor. I got lucky. I'm just getting started. It's an honor. I'm just pleased to have done as well as I did. And we're pleased to have such a gracious champion. Now, to the victor goes But you, you could see for yourself, it, it wouldn't, like, flick so to the chick in front of me. And I'm like, what do you want me to, to do, game? You with this simple yet elegant token of supreme dueling accomplishment. Yes. Thank you. Thank Give me the you. thing. It's been an honor. You earned it. You are a jewelist to be reckoned with. Tell me it's glasses or something, because I want to take this stupid mask winner, off. <laughs> I suppose I should get back to my schoolwork. Wonder how my herbology plants are doing. I haven't tended them in ages. Mm. Cross Wands Champion Garb. Yes. Yes, Lucas. Challenges. Oh, does it mean I've completed a challenge? Legendary cape? Uh, hang on. 
Legendary cape. Oh, swish. Cross Wands Championship Guard. Oh, look at me. I look like I'm in The Witcher or something. I look very swish. Yeah. Nice. Oh, broom. Flying mounts. Nice. Okay. What's in the collections? What's going on over here? Oh, enemies. Pensive Sentinel. Pensive Sentry. Oh, there's different dudes. I didn't even notice. <laughs> Oopsies. Okay. Hang on. Um, quests. Quests. I'm getting used to this UI. There's there's a lot. There's a lot in these menus, but it's actually fairly functional. Gobs of gobstones, or do we do the these main missions? How about let's look into the gobstone scenario situation. We'll squeeze in a few collectibles, eh? What's this? Venomous valor. Appearances. Daedalian keys. Ah, so can you can you mark these to? Oh, you can mark the quick travels as well. You know what, actually? Oh, hang on. How do I? Why is my camera stuck here? Wait, what just happened then? I quick did I accidentally quick travel? Oh, this camera is just. Fr oh. It's okay. Deep breaths. I doubt Scrivener would stand for that. Deep breaths. But if I said it was for an essay for history of magic, how? All right. How come I was stuck on that one area? That was weird, wasn't it? Like if I go into there, and I guess I can press red to come back out. So I think that's what happened. Maybe I just didn't press red. Maybe I'm just stupid and I didn't press red. I mean, this is absolutely, absolutely within the realm of possibility. Okay, how about... So what area is this? The Astronomy Wing. And then you've got Collection Chests, Field Guide Pages, Demi Guys Statues. Who's this bloke here? Venomous Valor. Let's go there. Let's do that. Let's just, let's potter around in the Astronomy Wing for a little bit. I'm enjoying this. I'm enjoying this immensely. Yeah, so collectibles, cosmetics, all these things that, let's be perfectly honest, are generally pretty tired, gamey tropes, right? How many people, you know, uh, uh, Assassin's Creed this, climb up tower that, collectathon that, spinnies. Like, the amount of people that crack the sads over that, and I can understand, I'm still an Ubisoft apologist because games are exactly that. They're fucking toys. They're amusement park rides. So I don't really Spare care if it's like collect 10,000 things and climb up, a, you know. I don't really, I don't, I'll, I'll finish my rant. I don't really love this this sort of narrative that the talking head press are pushing because they're getting self-serious in their shitty little lives. And everything has to be some high drama, avant-garde piece or something like that, some high art. Where it's just, it's a game. You know, Ubisoft doesn't need to change their formula because it knows what its audience is. Same as like FIFA 10,000 can stay the same. Anyway, my point is that this is doing a lot of those mechanics. Uh, project. But I think because of there's a healthy dash of love, there's authenticity to it, I suppose. Which I shouldn't really say, because I, I should go back and play the Assassin's Creed games like, you know... I know the Origins, the Egypt one, I really liked as well, because it's very... Yeah, I shouldn't say that, because there's a lot of authenticity put into you those as well. You wanted to speak with me? I did. Hello. I'm Duncan Hophouse. Hello, Duncan. Pleasure to meet you. I've heard all about you, of course. Yeah. Confronting trolls and dragons. Mate, I'm a bit of a big deal. You know? I've had some good luck. Why, thank you. Thank you. Oh, that's nice to hear. I've had my share of adventure. I hope my reputation's warranted. Uh, I'm going to presume humble. your reputation is, in fact, warranted. In which case, you are precisely the person I need. Oh, right. You Gun see, for hire. We were learning to repel boggarts in Professor Hecate's class. Oh, they're the nightmare and, monsters. Well, mine unfortunately took the shape of a, a puff scheme. They can be scary. What's to be scared of? 
Are you afraid of your own shadow too? Oh, it's so tempting to just be mean. But I mean, he's asking for help and he's... Uh, they can be scary. What's to be scared of? They're adorable. Why would you be afraid of a puff scheme? They seem question. adorable until one sticks its tongue up your nose. Regardless of oh, how no. reasonable I believe... I know people that probably pay be, extra for that. I'm beginning to get a reputation as a coward. Some have even taken to calling me... Puffskeen Dunkeen. <laughs> that's a good nickname. That's that's actually funny. Fuck it. I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna do it. <laughs> I'm sorry, but you have to admit that's rather clever. I do not have to admit that. Ever said the same thing. Anyway, I mean, to make I'm all worse, for being nice to this kid. Blurted out that I must be braver than people think, since I have been in the hidden herbology corridor. The hidden herbology corridor. Oh, here we go. Yes. Rumor has it that the herbology professor before Professor Garlic kept dangerous plants there. It's supposedly so overrun now that no one dares enter it anymore. I was hoping you could go there and bring back evidence that I could use to show that, well, I'd gone in. But you haven't Say a gone. a bit of an exceptionally dangerous plant of some kind. I mean, sure. Like, I'm not out here trying to give life lessons. However, this mission, as I understand it, is to help a fucking coward be more of a coward and a liar. As opposed to, oh, I don't know. Why don't we go in there together, Duncan, and we face some real challenge, and you harden up and get a bit of concrete in your diet. What sort of plan? But instead, we're just going to... This bloke... We're going to reinforce this bloke's developmental have you seen inaptitude. the kinds of plants Professor Garlic grows? If the previous professor was anything like her... I'd imagine they're not exactly harmless. I'll see what I Very well. Lose if it. I'm in the area, perhaps I shall take a look. Grand. I'd very much appreciate it. Come and find me if you get the proof. I shall be forever in your debt. Great. And you know who this bloke's going to grow up to be? He's going to grow up to be, hmm. you know, a balding soy mid-30s bloke. Intriguing. Who, uh... Who lives terminally online and, uh, you know, attacks people for their views. <laughs> I'd better keep an eye on high and, and all we're doing is help reinforce that. Oh, well, hang on. So if I've got that mission available now, Venomous Valor. Right. Because I thought there were. Maybe I could just go around collecting missions. See, if I click this, will I travel to it? No. Oh. I'm confused. Oh, here we go. Hang on. There's someone standing next to me. Oh, I think it was that Sheila that was just screaming into the void. Let's go have a chat with her. Where am I? The Dedalian keys are back. Aren't they brilliant? Who are you talking to? Is everything all right? Yes. I'm sorry. I'm just... I'm Nelly, by the way. Hello, Nelly. I'm just so excited that the Dedalian keys are back. The what keys? The Dedalian keys. Surely you've seen them flying about. Rumor is that a former headmistress, Professor Moll, conjured them to protect the contents of certain locked cabinets years ago. Professor Black couldn't be bothered to disenchant the keys, mm. and they appear every few years. You should try to catch one. Why would I do that? Each key will lead you to a locked cabinet somewhere in the castle. Oh. If you can manage to get the key into the cabinet lock, not an easy task, you may find a reward. Oh, I don't know. I'm a bit of a master of sticking things in holes. Why would the headmistress do such a thing? Why would Professor Mole conjure flying keys? What I heard is that it had something to do with keeping peeves out of things. But that may or may not be true. He's uh. a poltergeist. <laughs> I thought they could go almost anywhere. Right? Why don't you follow the keys? Surely you'll be trying to complete the challenge as well. Ah, uh, I've tried, and I can't even get past the first cabinets. Great. Perhaps you'll have better luck. I'd love to World know what's in the world needs more incompetent wizards or witches, I suppose. I guess you can go work in Hogsmeade and sell fucking, you know, napkins Perhaps I'll or give something. It a go. I hope you do. <laughs> I guess that's what happens fact, to people that can't figure out basic magic in, the in this game. Tower. You should listen for them. <laughs> I hope you follow a few keys at least. If you manage to open a cabinet, I'd love to know what you find. If keys. anything. Let's 
find the Dalian keys in the astronomy tower. I need to know about this. So these are the ones I think Harry had to catch one in the first movie, didn't he? The one with the bung wing. It had already been manhandled. God, imagine that being one of these keys. What a shit existence that'd be. You're just this thing with wings that people want to stick you in holes. Like, God, that'd be awful. And then, like, they break your wings and that. They just... Oh. I don't know, man. I don't know. All right, let's go. Do 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 do. Jeez, we're going on a merry adventure, aren't we? Oh, where am I going? Where am I going? Incendio. Nope. I must change that spell. Levitatoes. Lumos. Disillusionment. Wait, I'm I'm an idiot. It's this one. Yep, yep, yep. I'm an idiot. Field guide page. Oh, excuse me. Dude, how cool is this swirly place? Hello. Oh! A ghost man. Up and up and up we go. Oh, I found another. You can't imagine how What's this? Was before I classroom? I'm trying to remember if I've seen this classroom in the movies. Probably, right? Oh, what's this? My dear Satyavati, you'll be pleased to hear that I received word from my contracts at Cambridge who conceded that they had in fact been incorrect in their understanding of meteor showers. It seems that an Irish astronomer and a British astronomer both built upon the work done by an Italian astronomer. Is this a joke? Like a man walks into a bar? All muggles mind you as far as I know. To propose calculating the position of the dust at Earth's orbit as means of connecting meteors to comets. Brilliant really, one can only imagine they might, what they might do with an enchanted telescope. Frustratingly, in my correspondence, I did feel that I had to continue using the pseudonym from my days as a gentleman scholar. Um, whilst I still find it rather exciting to have a secret identity, the reason it works me. I'm so looking forward to our trip later this year to Gentar Mantar, what an adventure we have. I miss you, dear sister. I hope you're well. With love, Shushrita. Okay, cool. Might be a reference in there that I don't fully understand. Hello. Level lock. Oh, spinnies, get out of the way! I need to spin. Spinnies. How nice to see you, my young friend. You too, wall lady. Wow, where are we going now? A Dedalian key. Oh. Wonder where it might lead me. Okay, I found the key. Now I follow it. Shit, where'd it go? Revelio. Revelios. Ah, uh, oh. There's the cabinet. How do I get this key in there? How do I get slap? <laughs> what? Oh. Brilliant. Oh. <laughs> its wings broke off. Oh. An old coin. Perhaps Nelly knows what it means. Ah. House token. Turn to Nelly with the token. Off on another adventure, are we? I am, yes. I like her chipper attitude to it, right? If you're a wall sconce and you've been there for 10 billion years watching people, you know, on adventures. Like, that'd be rough. I can see the temptation to turn to bitterness. But she instead she's like, oh, off on an adventure? She's probably got the thickest skin on the planet. I guess she's made out of stone. Like I'm just walking, I'm just running past. Off on another adventure. Oh, ignoring me again. That's okay. Very good. You know, like, I suppose after hundreds of years of that interaction, you probably, I don't know how you keep a positive attitude, actually. I think you're overthinking it, Scarlet. Maybe. 
Regardless, the wall sconce lady seems pretty cool. Fast travel lady, whatever you want to call it. Were you Hello. able to follow one of the Dedalian keys? Hello, Nelly. I managed to get a Dedalian key into its lock. Brilliant. What did you find in the cabinet? A curious token of some sort. Looks like some sort of house token. I bet it unlocks house chests. I call them house chests. I've seen the one in Gryffindor and heard they're also in the other common rooms as well. Mm. Keep an eye out. I do right. hope you continue on. For so much effort, the prize must be something grand. Insert the house token into your I house chest. I should this through and find the Hufflepuff house chest. Yeah. Good. All right, we'll go back to the common room. That'll be good. Or I could just wait until the game forces me back there for fast travel. Oh, I don't know. Whatever. Anyway, I hope you're enjoying this. I'm enjoying it immensely. Um... Yeah, longer form people requested, so I figure we'll do that and we'll um we'll try and see if we can get through this quick smart. Anyway team, let me know what you reckon. I might just leave it there for the time being and I'll catch you guys in the next one.